Hello, my name is Maurice Maloney and I'm the Executive Director of the Global Institute for Food Security here on the campus of the University of Saskatchewan. Hi, my name is Wilf Keller. I'm currently serving as the President and CEO of Ag West Bio Inc. here in Saskatoon. And we're here to tell you a little bit about a conference we are organizing in June 2016 here in Saskatoon, uh, in which we are going to discuss uh, uh, internationally the role of technologies, emerging technologies, for global food security. There's no question going forward looking into the future that food security on this planet is going to be an important and challenging issue. We're going to have 9 to 10 billion people living here in 30 years from now and we have to address their, their needs for food and nutrition. And this means at least a 70% increase in production over what we have now in terms of food uh, products. Now that poses an enormous problem for us because there are two major parts of the agricultural economy that need to be serviced. First of all, what we would think of as the industrialized world, uh, the rich uh, world that generates large amounts of primary food products, the grains and oil seeds. Um, we will need to deliver much larger amounts of food from those sources because as the population increases, that will include many people with increased buying power, uh, almost a large emerging global middle class. But at the same time, if we look at countries in uh, sub-Saharan Africa, in South Asia, we know well that there are many people living a subsistence lifestyle with very low yields. And there are technologies that ought to be able to help those people to go from growing corn at less than one ton per hectare to something more reasonable like three to four tons per hectare, which would completely change uh, their ability to feed uh, their families. Uh, this is a very interesting challenge and in many ways also an opportunity. Do you see ways, Maurice, in which we can fast track some of these technologies and deal with these effectively to meet people's needs? And I think, Wolf, that's a critical point. Much of the research that we do tends to be focused on uh, improving agriculture in the developed world and we are very good at that. But what we forget is it is possible, even with high technology discoveries, to be able to repackage those and mobilize them more rapidly directly into the developing world. If we can do that, we have the possibility on a relatively short time scale of increasing these yields and improving the situation uh, of people who live in such poverty. So please join us. Uh, from the 14th to the 16th of June 2016 at the beautiful Bespera Hotel in uh, Saskatoon for our conference on emerging technologies for global food security. And I very much look forward to seeing you there.